Happy International Women's Day. We're here in the Winnipeg Gallery, and I'm going to tell you a little bit about two generations of uh, Manitoba women who are featured here in the gallery. Um, these women of Cree descent um, played a really important role uh, here in Manitoba. Now, behind me is a tea gown that belonged to Edith Rogers. And so this is the kind of thing she would wear um, when uh, uh, entertaining guests in her home. And, you know, talk would sometimes turn to politics. And especially during the First World War, um, Edith was very involved in volunteer efforts here on the home front and was very concerned about returned soldiers. Um, and this would lead her into politics. And she would become the first female uh, MLA elected in Manitoba. And what's so interesting about her is that her daughter, Margaret Connitz, who's also featured in our gallery here, um, followed in her footsteps, very involved in social causes, very involved in the, the volunteer effort in the Second World War. Margaret Connitz would become the first female MP to be elected from Manitoba. And when we asked uh, their family, you know, what are some of the things that uh, they were most uh, proud of uh, with Margaret Connors, um, they mentioned that uh, she was the only woman on the committee that chose Canada's current flag, our maple leaf. So two very interesting and significant Manitoba women. Happy International Women's Day. <laughs>